Good morning, KNV. Today I'll read about the color black from the poem book Hailstones and Halibut Bones by Mary O'Neill. Here's the cover. Remember, you can use your five senses to think of today's color in new ways your sense of sight, your sense of hearing, your sense of smell, your sense of taste, and your sense of touch. Now, Poems can also create images in your mind, like a picture in your mind as you read. Let's read today's color poem. Arthur picked this color as his favorite color. Today, Arthur, this color poem is just for you. What is black? Black is the night when there isn't a star and you can't tell by looking where you are. Black is a pail of paving tar. Black is jet and things you'd like to forget. Black is a smokestack. Black is a cat, a leopard, a raven, a high silk hat. The sound of black is boom, 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 echoing in an empty room. Black is kind. It covers up the rundown street, the broken cup. Black is charcoal and patio grill. The spot, the soot spots on the window sill. Black is a feeling hard to explain, like suffering but without the pain. Black is licorice and patent leather shoes. Black is the print in the news. Black is beauty in its deepest form the darkest cloud in a thunderstorm. Think of what starlight and lamplight would lack, diamonds and fireflies, if they couldn't lean against black. So can be today's color is black. Think of this color in new ways today. Draw or paint a picture with today's color in your mind. You can also write your own color poems. Share all of them with us so we can think and create images in our minds. Use poetry in a new way in your day. I miss you all and I'll think of you each and every time I'm reading poems and I'm going about my day and thinking about today's color. Have fun and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.